Hello, Stampers. Uh, here we are in at the Dome with these ladies here. Class with, there's Lynn Hi. and Patty. Hello. <laughs> and we are doing the May Paper Pumpkin. I'm sharing mine with the girls. And uh, what they're doing right now is stamping on the envelopes. We're putting the trees on the envelopes. And we're doing, um, I'll show you, hang on. Here's the card that we're starting with. We're gonna do this one first, and then we'll do this one. These are the ones that the girls liked, okay. What I told the girls is before they use the uh, photo Palmer ink, uh, stamps, which is the clear stamps, the cling ones, to always stamp with the Versamark first initially, and then we put it in the color. Now the color this, month we're using is what's it say misty moonlight moonlight okay oh, that's new yeah that's new. so we stamp with this first and then like that blue. helps it to uh, the ink to adhere you only do it, it the first like time and i've always told the girls to stamp on your placemat first beautiful that's going to be nice and it Play turned it out great nice on here. <laughs> yeah and then we're going to put it on the white Now Patty is stamping hers down. And I like the cling stamps because you can see through them. To, oh, perfect. Okay, Lynn, ink yours up. And she's note that she's got the piercing pad, which really helps um, with these cling stamps because you, sometimes you need a little cushion underneath. And so that's what Lynn is doing, putting her um, paper on the pad, the cushion, and stamping. And of course, lens always turns out perfect too. Oh, I know. <laughs> no. Okay, like I said, this is a paper pumpkin kit. Uh, and then uh, I'll show you, we're doing these two cards here. You get the directions for each card your supplies and everything, what you're supposed to do. Um, this is, we're doing card two right now. And it shows you what to ink and to use um, the glue dots and what to put the dimensionals on. And then um, how to assemble your card. There's also a Stampin' Up! video to show you how to do this. Okay, because we put dimensionals on the back of this piece right here, then when we put um, the blue piece right here, we're going to, it shows you, if you look at your directions, you're going to put a glue dot on the left side and then two dimensionals on the right because um, this is raised. And you'll see whenever you put it down, it'll be even. Okay. Because the, the circle with the trees on it was raised, then you're just going to put it down, just like I, I did in the card there that she's looking at. Yeah, there you go. Perfect. So when you're assembling this card for your sentiment, you're only going to place half of it on the blue strip because uh, that's how you do it. <laughs> <laughs> because I said so. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and there you go. Perfect. Okay. Yeah, so it's just the bottom half that you put the glue on. Yep. And then you can put that mm -hmm. on the front of your card. We got to stamp on the inside. Yeah, stamp on the inside. Okay. We always do the inside first. We don't always stamp a sentiment inside, but today we're going to. And so I asked the girls to do that first, just in case there is an incident that you don't like the way it looks. <laughs> we can always cover it up with another piece of cardstock. So that's what they're going to do now. And again, she's going to stamp on her placemat to see 
if she likes the coverage. Oh, that looks great. So now she's going to ink it up again and put it on the inside. And we've already done the Versamark on all these stamps that we're using today. And so uh, the ink is going to adhere. Perfect. Look at that. <laughs> okay, Len's just finishing up putting her panel piece on the card. And look at the pretty cards, how nice they are. The girls, they both turned out so nice. So we're going to go ahead on to the second card, which is this one. And these were the three cards for the May Paper Pumpkin. I hope you guys enjoyed this video today. And tune in for next month. Maybe the end of this month, we'll be doing more. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.